Well, hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today I have three mystery packs from the Sun and Moon Unified Mindset that was released in 2017 to 2019. I picked up these packs from the local Dollar General around the corner for $3.50 and normally when I go in there they only have the unbroken bonds so when I seen that they were stocked up and they had the Unified Minds I had to go ahead. I just picked up three packs. Our first one we get a Nicket, not bad. I have plenty of Nickets already in the collection. We are aiming for something a little heavier. They have plenty of secret rares and gold ultra rare cards in these collections. And because these are mini booster packs, you're only gonna get three cards. So if you were to go ahead and get these online, they would be closer to seven, eight dollars a piece. So for three dollars, not bad, we get a little Collect battle and trade card. Uh, this looks like more along the lines of digital art. You could start a nice little collection uh, <clears throat> if you like to have some Pokemon trading card game art online. So that's not bad. It's not something you see every day. So, like I was mentioning, we only get three cards. So, hopefully, the first pack we get something nice. Typically, I usually see common cards. I've been buying these for a few months now. We got a nice little uh, Swat Loon Reverse Hollow. That's a beautiful card. They make them a little different than the Sword and Shield. As always, the sets are going to have different art and illustrators and an Orangaroo. So the first pack, nothing too special. We're going to go ahead, move on to pack number two, Unified Minds. Hopefully, we get something uh, a little bit nice. We've been wanting to pull uh, secret rares and gold cards for a while now. They're hard to get your hands on, especially if you were to go online and buy them individually. They can range anywhere from five to 30 or $40. So pack number two, we got a Zerud Reverse Hollow from Sword and Shield. And like I was mentioning in one of my prior videos, I didn't know Sword and Shield was incorporated in these packs. I thought they were all Sun and Moon cards. So let's go ahead, open up pack number two. Hopefully one of these three cards is something special we would love to grab like i was saying a secret rare or gold card even anything gx worthy would be nice i don't have many unified time cards so this is the start of my collection uh, we'll go ahead and show off the binder here later on so we're going to make our way pack number two we got a common card uh, nothing too special let's go ahead make our way through see what we can grab and there we go and again we got a rallet and a lowland executor gx full art what a beautiful card uh number one uh out of 236 so that is an exciting grab look at that so we're gonna go ahead sleeve that card up and on un unidentified fossil so yeah we're gonna go ahead and sleeve that card up add that to the collection we'll probably go ahead and throw the prices up see what that's going for online see uh see if it's worth even sending in to get graded to psa i'll take a look at it myself see how the back is but moving on to pack number three well if we don't grab anything special on this one i'm not too upset that gx was kind of exciting already so we get a energy uh treasure energy reverse hollow nice card again from sword and shield so it's going to be a very common card and let's go ahead and see what the last mini booster pack has in store. Like I was saying, I'm already really excited. We pulled a GX full art on pack number two. So my day has already been made, but if we pull another one, better yet. So let's go ahead, check out what the last three cards have in store for us. And we got a Pikachu. All right, so I actually don't have a Pikachu from the Unified Mindset, so that's kind of exciting. There's plenty of Pikachus made across the board, so. We got a Hoopa, Reverse Hollow. Uh, nice card, nothing too special though. And the last one is a Pokemon Research Lab. So yeah, we did get that pull today. I appreciate everyone for stopping by, watching the video. If you wouldn't mind just leaving a like and then subscribing to the channel for more Pokemon content and pulls, it would be greatly appreciated. Again, I appreciate you guys for stopping by. Take care.